Yes, Massive, welcome back to Reggae Dance Hall Vault. And today we want to talk about a song called Wet Dream, done by reggae legend Max Romeo. In 1969, Max Romeo had a song called Wet Dream. This was his first solo recording, which became a major hit, especially in England, but was eventually banned by the BBC because it was deemed sexually suggestive. Even without getting earplay, this song was on the British charts for many weeks. Now, Max Romeo explained that his song is of no way sexual in nature, but the BBC wasn't having it, you know. Before we get to the explanation, just watch a little clip with Max Romeo performing Wet Dream. This next song I'll do for you is requested. It's requested by quite a few people here tonight. It's a song I really don't do anymore. This song was recorded in 1969. What a year. It was in the British shop for 26 weeks. Some of you might remember it if you're old enough. This was banned by the BBC in the hands. <laughs> Only played twice on the radio and made it the number two in the charts. I can't remember on top of the pops. Number two this week is that song from this guy. It was only a picture. <laughs> I'm gonna perform that song for you tonight. This song is called Wet Dreams. <laughs> Pull up, pull up, pull up, my singer, pull up, guys. This lie down girl, I make me push it up, push it up. It's on, it's on more than suggestive. But the singer said, This is not so. So, we could go to the explanation from the singer. Come talk to them, legend. Romeo turned out to be a new kind of rude boy. Because there's the wonderful Max Romeo wet dream thing which was uh, just such a great pop record or that obviously the lyrics on you know you can see why they had a problem with that lie down gal let me push it up push it up but i tried to explain i said look man i'm not i have nothing to do with sex i'm talking about my house leaking here me and my lady sleeping in bed rain falling the, the leak, the roof is bloody leaking. She's getting up to to, 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 to to plug the leak, and I'm saying, lie down, girl, I'll push it up. They didn't buy that. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we don't buy it neither, John. No, but we don't buy it neither, but massive. You can't imagine, you know, you have a big monster song like this, and the people them take on to it, but it now nah get no play up on the ear. Yeah, man, you have to say something for try to get it on the radio or, you know, something, but, boy, BBC wasn't having it. I just one of them things there, you know. 
But yeah, man, them things yeah, we just want to bring back to the forefront. Because of the vault, you know, and we're going on the vault and we dig up certain things and we bring it back. And, you know, people enjoy it and things. And who never knew about it, know about it, no one. And who didn't know about it already are just memories, you know. Yeah, man, but Massive, I want to look forward to the tribute to Max Romeo coming soon. So, all right, I'm going close out with Danny McEvoy doing a cover of Max Romeo's Wet Dream. Shit up, lie down. You and 